Greetings, fellow detectives. Wizard Kitten here, bringing you part six in our walkthrough for Nancy Drew Trail of the Twister. We just ran a couple errands here at Ma and Pa's store. We got a new vacuum pump for Chase so he can help us save the prairie dogs. Ooh. And we uh, got a mouse trap for Scott because he is very upset about the mouse situation at the Canute Farmhouse. So let's see. Let's talk to Chase. Hey there. I went to Paws and got a bigger tube for that prairie dog vacuum. This okay? Well, let's find out. It's kind of see-through. There you go. One-handed dandy prairie dog vacuum. How does it work? We just turn it on, stick the tube in the hole, and all the critters in the burrows going to that hole will be sucked into the bag. That sounds a little rough. Are you sure they're going to be okay? Of course they will. Built this baby here with safety in mind. That's why it's so ugly. Now don't forget, if there ain't any critters in the burrows going to that hole, you'll lose suction and some of the ones that you've caught will escape. You gotta make sure you catch all of them before you move them. Okay. Just keep at it and you'll do fine. There's some paw panties in if you remember to bring this back when you're done. Don't want it falling into the wrong hands. Prairie Dog's life is rough enough as it is. Okay. Anything else on your mind? I'd better get going. Adios. <laughs> All right, we have a prairie dog vacuum. And he said he'll give us paw pennies, which is good because we actually need some to buy some cheese. So let's go save the prairie dogs. I love prairie dogs. They're so cute. Look at them. Oh, they're so adorable. Okay, so we need to use this weird vacuum thing. And we need to basically put it over a hole where you know there will be a prairie dog. Oh, we lost suction. What happened there? Okay. That did not work at all. <laughs> okay. We're doing very poorly. Okay. That one was better. Oh, no. Okay. Got another one. Oh, they got away. <laughs> it's almost like whack-a-mole but with prairie dogs that was a pretty good one okay wait till they appear oh he got out he got away you're prairie doggies wow oh. I'm having a hard time getting him. There's only two more. Why can't I get him from there? Or is there only one more? Three more? There we go. Oh, nope. Nope, they got away. <laughs> Little buggers. Why can't I get him? Got Ugh, I was gonna get them. It's weird. I can't figure out why I'm struggling so much to get them. Huh. Here, prairie doggies. Oh no, one of them got away. Oh no, a couple of them got away. Stop! <laughs> no, come back. No! That was sad. Okay, come back. I'm trying to save your lives, you little buggers. Why won't you stay put? Okay, we got three. That's a plus. Oh. This is particularly difficult today for some reason. I don't know why I'm struggling so badly. Usually this goes a lot faster, but apparently today is just a rough prairie dog day. See, they won't stay in there. That's so weird. Okay, please get all of them. Got them! Okay. I, th I got all the prairie dogs. Cool. Okay, now we're going to move them over to the other side of the barn. Which is, I think, over here. Just around the corner here. Looks like the perfect new home for the prairie dogs. 
I'd better empty out the vacuum here. Here you go, little guys. Good luck in your new home. Just traumatized, poor things. Oh, hey. It kind of looks like the money box I found at the farmhouse. Terms are agreed. Series of CB with CC or CG from an HP storm by June 2nd. Upon delivery, payment will be rendered in the amount of $550. Interesting. That sounds very specific. Hmm. Okay, let's give this back to Chase. Hey there. I'm all done with the prairie dog vacuum. Here you go. All righty then. Anything Ooh. else on your mind? I'll let you go. Adios. So now that will let us buy some cheese so we can use the mouse trap to get the mice out of uh, Scott's office. So let's go to pause real quick and get some cheese. Wee. Wee. Oh. <laughs> Sorry. I'm amazed Nancy hasn't been arrested for negligent driving. What can I do for you, little lady? Don't ask again, Nancy. Where's Ma? Still not here? <laughs> nope. She, uh, she had to drive over to Chickasha. Sisters Lumbago's acting up. Anything else I can help you with? Good seeing you again. Don't let them canutes work you too hard. Huh, <sighs> sad. Okay. Let's get some cheese, Moonchunk. And now let's go back to Scott's office and try to catch those cute little mice. I actually really like mice. I think they're adorable. Um, pet rats, believe it or not, are actually very cute and very intelligent and a lot of fun. Uh, and they're better than hamsters because hamsters usually bite. I mean, they can be pretty nippy, but uh, rats usually don't. Rats are pretty chill. Wouldn't expect it. You're back, and you've got a trap. Good. The mice seem to hang out a lot by the wall. Try putting it there. Just don't leave till you've caught them. All of them. <laughs> that was the first time Scott actually seemed happy about something that I did, which is fantastic. Okay, so we're going to put our little mouse trap down here. We're going to plop the cage, and then I think we have to put a little bit of cheese. Mm. No, Nancy, no! I just ate the cheese. No. No. <laughs> no. Now we have to go to circuit boards for Jace. Oh, man. That was annoying. Okay, well, now you'll get to see how the circuit boards work. <laughs> Nancy, why did you eat the cheese? Okay, these are the directions for the circuit boards. Basically, you just need to connect them all so that the wires have the right numbers. So like here we want three wires going out of it and here we want two. So you have two wires connecting on each side and then you turn the power on to see if it works and then you get paid. Oh goodness. Now we just get to see a few of these. This is honestly a very large portion of the game, and I don't think it should be as large of a portion as it actually is. <laughs> it's one of those things that are just a little bit time-consuming, kind of busy work, and they lose their luster after a while. After a while, no worries if you really enjoy games like mini puzzles like this. Absolutely, kudos to you. Like they can certainly be fun, but. Personally, I would rather be spending my time doing something else than solving circuit board puzzles. All right. Enough complaining from me. One, two, three, four, five, six, and four. That looks good. You don't even get more paw pennies when you do, like, harder puzzles, which I think is a little bit of a shame. Let's see. Three. The ones in the corners that are three, you're always going to know your answer. Um, and that'll usually open up a four for you as well. Let's see. Um, five. One, two, three. It's going to have to be here. Four, five. Okay, that's good. I'm going for about 100 because we need 95 coins to be able to um, get the cheese. Here's four. Four, two, 
Let's see, one, two, three, four here. One, two, one, two, three, four, five, six. There we go. Okay, power on. Next board. Okay, we're up to 70. This is good. We're doing good. We are doing solid. Solid work, Nancy. Oh, yeah, and like this five, we those are the only possibilities for it, so we know those will always go that way. Four we know. Two we know. Let's see. Maybe um, one, two, three, and then five. That looks pretty good. Power on. Party on. Wait, Wayne? <laughs> yeah, party on, Wayne. Party on, Garth. That's what it made me think of for some strange reason. Wayne's World. Classic movie. Um, let's see. Zero here. So we're going to need to do three like that. Two, three, one, two, three, that's four, that looks good. Aha, perfect. Okay, we're gonna exit now. All done. Cause we got a hundred pennies. I am real impressed with your work, Nancy. You earned every one of those pennies. All right, I did earn every one of those pennies. So now we're gonna go back to pause and then we're gonna go get some more cheese. Then we're gonna go back to the farmhouse and we're gonna catch some mice. But don't worry, this won't be the only time we'll catch mice. We're going to do it again. <laughs> Sorry. <sighs> okay, let's try that again. Oops, I don't want juice. I want cheese. Moon chunk cheese. Purchased. Turn around. Go back. No, I don't need water. Stop trying to sell me things that I don't need, Pa. Whoa! Okay, that was a close call. That's basically what I say every time I open up Instagram. Stop trying to sell me things that I don't need, but that I totally want. <sighs> Targeted advertising is way too effective sometimes. Okay, let's try this again. Don't eat the cheese, Nancy. Put down the cage. Open this up. Put in the cheese. <laughs> Oh, see, look how cute it is. It's adorable. I better make sure to fill all of the traps. Okay, so you want to get a mouse in Make sure every you catch single... all of them. Yes, Scott, thank you. You want to make sure you get a mouse in every single square by rotating this little doohickey here is one way that you can do that. We can... I like to let the mouse kind of file all the way in. The mice file all the way in. They'll kind of block each other at first here. And then we just turn this so that the mouse can go down that way. And then we'll get a new mouse and turn it again. And then he'll go down there. And then we'll get a new mouse. And then we'll turn it again. And then they'll bump into each other. And one of them will go up there. See, it's perfect. Now why don't you go up? There you go, little cutie pie. And they're eventually gonna like bump into each other. So this one's gonna go down that way. And then this one will turn around and in they go. It'll be perfect. Beautiful. This is really a lot of mice. No place has this many mice in one room just coming into one trap. Mice are not this dumb. This is that realistic. Should do it. <laughs> Okay. I got him. Well, finally. Now take him outside and dump him. The spring house out on Old Orchard Road. That should be far enough away. Let him go there. You got it. Okay, we're going to go to the spring house, apparently, and deliver the mice. So let's go outside. Let's go to our handy little car here. And let's see where the spring house is. So the spring house is down here, which actually has some more cloud formations. Maybe we'll find another one that we can take a picture of. Am I going the right way? Probably not. Yeah. Okay, I gotta go up. Whoa! Oh gosh. That's the windmill. Oh, it's pretty out today, though. Let's take a picture. Because it's beautiful. Save. Okay. So nice. Now, we need the spring house, though. Oh, pff, I was still navigating us to the windmill, that's why. Spring house, let's try again. 
Spring House is north of here and to the east. Wow. Wow. <laughs> Yeehaw. Um, up again, and then to the right. There we go. Okay. Let's dump out the mice, this lovely little spring house. Aw, cute little guys. They're just so cute. Do we have any good clouds? No, but this is a very pretty little area. I like it. I want to explore in there hardcore. Like, I really wish we could go in there. That would be fun. That's perhaps one of my top list of places that I wish we could explore that we can't. Along with um, the pub in whoa, the Silent Spy. That's another place that I really want to be able to um, explore that we can't go in. That would be really cool if we could. Okay, um, maybe let's check in with Debbie and see if we got anything else we need to do today. Any jobs? Let's move! This storm is about to go critical! We need to get out in the field now! You're riding point with Frosty. Scott and I will be tracking the storm. Let's go! What storm? What are we talking about? <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> I'm riding point with Frosty? What am I driving? Something tells me this isn't the right car. Woohoo! We're gonna get a twister! We are? Oh, that was sudden. Okay, where are we going? Viewpoint, probably? Okay. So we're going up this... <laughs> Sorry, we're on our way to a twister. You kind of need to get out of our way. <laughs> Excuse us. <laughs> oh, yeah, this is definitely twister area. Oh, check that out. No. No, no, no. Shoot. Video camera just died. Here, fix it. I've got to keep shooting stills. Oh, my gosh. Okay. So we have to put these in order from um, 1 to 100. So let's see. All the numbers need to be touching at some point, and it's good to try and not block off too many. Um, that's usually where I end up with issues. So 10. Where is 11, 12, 13? Where's 14? Oh, over here. Okay, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16... 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, um, let's see, where would that be best? Maybe here, 25, 26, we need to get over to 31, 27, 28, I think maybe 27 would be better there, 28, 29, 30, no, that's not going to work, 28, 29, no, 30, 29, 28, 27, maybe more like that will be better, 20, okay, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, okay, this is the part where I always get stuck is this bottom corner, 35, because we need to find a way to be able to get out, 36, 37, 38, 39. Okay. Um. 36, 37. It's amazing 30, 30, 30, out here. 40, 41, okay, okay. <laughs> Pressure! 35. Okay, 34. 35. 36. Because it. 30 definitely has to touch there. 41, 42. How do we get this available? This pretty much has to go here. 34, 35, 36. Unless we were to go. This has to touch 38, doesn't it? Yeah, 38, 37. So we're gonna need 43 really to be here, I think. Or here, 37. 
37 has to be here. 35 35 36 37 38 39 but then 40 can't touch uh, 38 so we need to have 37 there Nine has to go there, because that's the only way the nine and the ten will touch. Thirty-three. Can we go up? Like, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, forty, forty-one, forty-two, and then maybe forty-three... 44, 45, 46, 47, that looks right. 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53. Okay, okay, we're getting there. 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60. Okay, but now we need to get down here. Oh boy. Boy, oh boy. Okay, wait. 12, 13. We can do this. We can do this. 60. 5, 5. Can we do this? 4, 5, 6, 7. <laughs> Sorry, the commentary here is not great. 61. 27. 28. 29. 30. Okay, 61. 62, 63, 64, 65. That's working. 66. 67. Maybe 68, 69, 70, 71, 72, 73, 74, 75, 76. Okay, 77, 78, 79, 80, 81, 82, 83, 84. Ah! Um, 27, 28, 84, 85, 86, 87, 88. It. Here you go, Frosty. Ooh. Just in time, thanks. Uh oh, we got some trouble. The funnel is headed right for that building. Oh no! Look at that! Knock that barn flat! I hope it was as abandoned as it looked. It's roping out. It didn't record a thing. I thought you said you fixed it. I did fix it. Let's head back to the homestead. So, still think tornadoes are cool? You bet I do. I think what they are is cool, but after today, I'm sure not a fan of what they do. That's something that researchers, myself included, all too often forget. As exciting as it is to chase tornadoes, they are hugely destructive, and the damage they do to lives and livelihoods is all too often horrible and irreparable. <sighs> what a disheartening day. An EF3. And we failed to get so much as one inch of footage on it, thanks to you. What do you mean, thanks to me? Frosty says you failed to fix his video camera in time to record anything. But, but that's not true. I fixed it in plenty of time. Look, I don't want to hear excuses. Just go. Call it a day and make sure it doesn't happen again, okay? Okay. Rude! We totally did fix it. Urgh, that makes me upset. All right, well, I think I'm going to leave this part right here, fellow detectives. Thank you so much for watching. I will see you soon.